So we also have a worst case user DLL. And so this DLL sets all our tolerances in the model to a modal distribution and leverages Monte Carlo simulations to determine the worst case build. Now this is a slightly more powerful tool, but it also gets a bit more confusing because as our inputs increase, it's going to take more total runs to determine that we'll be, you know, 95% confident that one of those builds we did was the minimum or was the maximum. Correct. So we have, this is what the dialog for the worst case simulation looks like, which I'll open up in one second and we move on to our second model.